welcome. We believe the message you're about to listen to will greatly impact your life richly. Remain blessed as you listen. First Kings chapter 17 from verse 1 media. Thank you. You all look good. Uh-uh. Put your hands together for yourself. I can see some of our visitors from Lukbe coming, and I can also see some new, new faces. Celebrate everybody that is here today. Amen. Father, we thank you. Lord, I pray for this service. I ask that you help us today. Let me minister to somebody. And may these words not just be mere words. May they come with power and anointing. In Jesus' name we pray. Much thanks to the people that one or two persons gave us some good alert. I just the Holy Spirit told me, make sure you announce that we're going to have a media stand here. So it was supposed to be two. It will still come. We're still open for the alerts. I got some two good alerts, beautiful alerts that made us to have this yesterday. There's one that's going to still stand here. This is not how it's going to stand. So please pardon the media team. It's going to stand more beautiful. We're not a Jaga Jaga church. Hallelujah. Amen. Father, I bless them, every man who contributed to this. At making things easy, Lord, you will make things easy for them. In the name of Jesus. First Kings chapter 17, verse 1 to 4. Minister Solomon, can you read it for me? With the preacher's voice. No, look at it. Look at it from the media. We are past that level. We can also read it from the media. 17 from verse 1. Okay. Oh. And Elijah the Tishbite, who was of the inhabitants of Gilead, said unto Ahab, As the Lord God of Israel liveth, before whom I stand, there shall not be dew nor rain these years, but according to my word. And the word of the Lord came unto him, saying, Get thee hence and turn thee eastward and hide thyself by the brook Cherith that is before Jordan. And it shall be that thou shalt drink of the brook and I have commanded the ravens to feed thee there. Five. So he went and did according unto the word of the Lord. For he went and dwelt by the brook Cherith, that is before Jordan. Six. And the ravens brought him bread and flesh in the morning, and bread and flesh in the evening, and he drank of the brook. Seven. And it came to pass after a while that the brook dried up, because there had been no rain in the land. And the word of the Lord came unto him, saying, Arise, get thee to Zarephath, which belongeth to Zidon, and dwell there. Behold, I have commanded a widow, a widow woman there, to sustain thee. Ten. So he arose and went to Zarephath, and when he came to the gate of the city, behold, the widow woman was there gathering of sticks. And he called to her and said, Fetch me, I pray thee, a little water in a vessel that I may drink. Thank you. Put your hands together for Minister Solomon. <laughs> Hallelujah. After a long prayer meeting like this, we had a, a good prayer meeting for about seven days. Today is the seventh day. Monday, Monday to Friday was five days. Yesterday, Saturday, six days. Today is the seventh day. And we prayed. No, we prayed. Yesterday, Saturday, the presence was, of God was here in a very unique way. But I know we prayed. 
Това е пътничия стат. is to make you to understand that after a long prayer like this God is going to expect a few things I don't want us to be a type of you know there are some set of persons that learn to they only want to live by miracle miracles happen miracle is a way of God's intervention but miracle is, is not you are not supposed to live by miracle Am I making sense? We are not supposed to be living by miracle. What do I mean living by miracle? It's like drugs. It's good. You take it, it helps your body, right? But are you going to allow mosquitoes to be biting you knowing because you know you have drugs in the cupboard? Huh? No, now. No. Somebody say prevention is better than cure. So I'm here this morning to tell you that you can really actually live your life outside every time believing God for an intervention. You can actually live your life like that. I know Christ- people who are not Christians, not tongue talking. They don't even come to church that live better than we Christians that have an added advantage. That is why scriptures say the people that are supposed to be on the horses are the ones trekking. The people that are supposed to be trekking are on the horses enjoying themselves. And then when they pass, you might greet them. Hey, how are you? Why? Because life is full of principles. You don't follow the principles, the implications will follow you. Am I making sense here? When the brook dried, I told him, turn this side. Sometimes brooks will dry. It's important for we Christians to learn to prepare. The unbeliever know how to save or how to prepare for the future more than us. So I told you that I'm going to teach on the three D's and three C's that have pushed my life seriously. So D number one today. I give this introduction because when you don't keep these things, you really, really suffer in this work. D number one is you ha- you must dare to dream. Tell your neighbor, dream. You didn't say that very well. Tell somebody, let the person hear very well, dream. Dream. Hallelujah. It's just so important to plan properly. Plan, plan, plan is important. For instance, if you live in a 200,000 naira house, 200,000 naira a year in this place, you must ask yourself, am I really qualified to stay in that type of house? How do you check your qualification? I do it so much, you, you calculate. 200,000 divided by 12 is so many. Somebody should divide it quickly. 200,000 divided by 12. I know the result, but I don't want to say it. Huh? Yes. 
It's about, let's say 16,700, 666, but 16,700. That means to stay in that house conveniently, you should be able to save or drop, not only save, drop 16,600 or 700 out of your salary conveniently every month. 16,700, you drop it one side. Or work for it and keep it one side. Or if you are not working for, if you are not getting up to that, you increase what will make you to get up to that. Divide it, this 16,700 by 30 days. You break these things down, they are not even very to, anything to fear. That means every day, if you live in a 200,000 dollar house, that means you qualify to make and keep 500 or 600 naira one side conveniently every day. If you qualify for that, maybe you qualify. Do you understand? So those are the ways sometimes the unbelievers calculate things. You see, the difference between we and the unbeliever is because we are supposed to live uh, when you are doing this calculation you add the Holy Spirit inside it helps you how to navigate it teaches you what to do but we don't use the two ways like that you see a Christian most of them the other day uh, Minister Philip here was just seeing us how he knew the time the landlord used to come if it's that so 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 time you will just find a way and disappear. If you're the type of Christian that is dodging landlords, running away from landlords, or living above your means, you're not doing it well. Eh? So I'm here to tell you that prayer will not work. Listen to me and listen to me well. Will not work without you putting your leg out. And following some of these principles. It will not work outside God's principles. So you see, have you ever seen a Christian, somebody who is a prayer warrior, he prays all the time, but you see that you don't have commercial, there's no commercial result. Have you ever seen that type of person before? You don't see evidence. I've seen many of them. They have prayer warriors. Those days we used to be in church, in my local church those days. The people that were in prayer band, I didn't want to join prayer band because I didn't envy the people that were in prayer band. They are the ones that their shoes were eating all this and they will be going like this. I don't know how, they don't even move too much, but they are the ones that their shoes got half holes more. Uh, big shoes, they will wear shoes like this. So they think that it's just all about sitting down doing and then they don't see results because they, they forget to practice other parts of this whole business. I pray a lot and we will pray a lot but we must do the other things that make things work. Prayer alone is not okay. Prayer gives you direction. Prayer should help you to dream. That's the D number one. Prayer should help you to plan. Prayer should help you to take a step. Cook this life above the normal. Something is going to happen to you. And the woman is gathering more rice by faith. As you are cooking, you are speaking in tongues. This rice will sell amongst thousands. Maybe you are cooking, you are putting the video, it's giving you some wrong vibe behind. And then you think that it will just work. My beloved is the most beautiful. And you are cooking. I'm not be saying you they do the my beloved is I'm cross your legs and looking for who please can I borrow one thousand naira from you? You will keep borrowing one thousand every day. Or ten two K every day. 
nothing is happening. As you are doing it, thousands, ten thousand. Where's the monkey? My beloved, is, is going to work today. I declare and I declare. As you are driving to work, you are doing the same thing. I'm going to see favor today. Thousands. That's how to do it. The be. You are walking. Ah, pray. Beautiful. Prayer is not magic. It doesn't happen with magic. So, but do you use that atmosphere? Do you know that when you, you are in that atmosphere, you do more. You do more. You are doing, working from the intuition of the Holy Spirit. He's saying, go this way. There's more favor this way. There are more species this way. The woman took her signboard and repositioned it. Ten thousand. Place this signboard here. Yeah, this place, there's God are here. It is the place. Place it here. My most beautiful. Put it here. That's where the people will see it. I must have. Somebody can say, ah, ah, it's a restaurant here. Ten thousand. There's a vibe that is firing around that signboard. There's a vibe that is going around the atmosphere. And then the smell. You begin to smell well. There's a normal, abnormal smell that keeps coming. As you speak, it talks and walk. Say Yeshua. Yeshua. Ah. That is how to do it. opinion that you will cross your leg inside the room and speak your tongues morning to night. Did you see the sun today? Did you see the sun tomorrow? I know from my, from my friends who have not seen sun for long like that. But one of the things you may enjoy is the presence of God. So if you enjoy the presence of God, they see revelation, they see dreams, and never take a step towards the dreams. First day I finished my school in the university. My wife was going for service. I had carryover. So I said, you go, madam, no problem. 2007. Yes, you are 2008, sorry. So you went to 9, right? But we'll finish around 2-8. I took my kayak as she was going to Abuja. Called my friend, oh God, I want to come and visit you. I came with two of my friends. I want to come and spend some time. I need direction. This school team will don't drop on one set. She will not say, if we go to school. We don't go to school. Uh, she was going to Calabar to serve. So me, I came to Abuja. Lord, Yeshua, Yeshua, give me direction, give me direction. I stayed in the room for three days. What next? What next? My beloved, what next? What next, Holy Spirit? What next? And I got direction. Pray, you also dream. What is a dream? Who can tell me what a dream is? It's not sleeping and having dream in the night. Though. It's not as what dream I'm talking about. Dream. Who can tell me what a dream is? With the preacher's voice. Aspiration. What is aspiration? Aspire. For somebody to ask. So people are so complex now. Every death thank you. They are so satisfied. Everything goes. Ha! I don't understand. I was telling the other one of my brothers in church. I said, you who? This voice. Are you not seeing this five point guest passing here? Or the people come and pick them. You don't aspire for anything good. They just sit down and be thinking. 
as you sing the most beautiful, as you fire among thousands, because you can never take the steps outside what you drink of. My beloved, shabada bada bada bada. You must dream, dream, dream. Some things will never work without a dream. Aspiration. I like that one. Any other one? Shebada bada bada. Dream. A mental picture. That's a dictionary definition. So person, their head is so blank. It's only okra. That's inside. And a goosey. The next Egusi, there's one man on Facebook that his work is just to eat. <laughs> so people watch, keep watching him and he is eating. He will just put three Egusi, put one, hot, hot, hot drink <laughs> with beer and coke and everything. <laughs> so people want to be like that man. The guy is a wise man. Though. As you are viewing it, he's getting money inside his bank. Uh, carrot with okra. <laughs> But the guy is even wiser than most of you that will just be sitting down and be thinking your thinking is only a goosey. Mental picture. And sometimes your environment has a way of affecting your mental picture. You don't know? You must dream. We pay the, the world of money that will do this stand. Roman put here. We were waiting for him. I went back to town, but I said, no, let me come back. This stand must stand. Sir. Behold, the word that enters with the stand, Mr. Chris. Ha. I said, even in my farm, I will not put that stand here. Carry it out. What are you, what, what is this? Put in front of the people what will inspire them. The man said, well, I will spend money. I said, Oga, carry this thing outside they wear the thing. This one was standing like this. One was standing like this. No, no. What you keep in front of you have a way of inspiring you. Where you stay is important. Where you also stay. Because you wake up every day is the environment what you keep seeing. Some of you need to jump out in your mind. These days you can live in America. Stay in a... I want to do... You can't live in America. The starting point is not an issue. But remaining there over the years, that's where there's an issue. You are not a dreamer. Dream. Put in front of you good pictures. Put in front of you the things that can change. When I was not even having a car, I would be walking on the streets. And be saying, I can will drive this car. I will cruise you. If I see them pass, I'll say, I will cruise in the name of Jesus. Me. And favor. Nothing will pass me. My beloved. Dream of the most beautiful. Don't be a complacent person. That's why I don't really watch news like that. Because there is so much evil going on. Not the type that will wake up in the morning and be playing Ember. Le- ember. <laughs> oh, lo, 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 lo. Then you hear the autopod did this, autopod did this. Your mindset has been crowded with evil. Any money, my beloved, is, are the songs I want to hear. Creating an atmosphere around the dream. You must dare to dream. You must dare to dream. Don't be a careless person. Don't be a complacent person. My beloved. The more it is better to be a good planner with the Holy Spirit. It will save you more than every time coming to church. And you refuse to hear an instruction. This money you got today, 
keep 20% as part of your rent or the children's school fees. No, there are too many things to do. You refuse to hear the instruction. The Holy Spirit tells you, no, farming is coming in the future. Keep 50,000 here. You carry the 50,000. You bought shoes. You bought clothes. You are not wise. It is better to live with the Holy Ghost and get those instructions and run with them than trying to every day come here for miracle. If you come, we'll pray. We'll pray. Lord, bless them. Miracle, miracle. Let it happen. But will you keep trusting God for the miracle every time? Every day you come to the hospital for drugs. They will give you the drug. But between the time the drug has not come and the this thing, you will be in pain. Sometimes you take the pain, the drug, but the pain still persists. It keeps persists because you refuse to initially stop. Please, I say these things to say that there's a way to live without this plenty complaints. We complain too much. <laughs> Hallelujah. A vivid imagination. Sometimes it's good to just sit down and imagine. Dreaming. Uh, have you not imagined something that sparked your mind? You will decide to wake up and take a step. Every day I took a step, those imaginations happened to me. One day I traveled to Joss. Those days we used to be with my, our friends. I used to move around with Dr. Panam, where I was one of his backup singers. Not really fully backup singer, but I was always with them. So we'll go do the administration. They will give us change, money we'll put in our pocket. One day I came to the house of the keyboardist, Dr. Panam's keyboardist in Joss. We were not able to come back to Abuja Street, pass through Joss. And I entered this house. I saw Palo. I said, ah, ah. They painted the Palo. You know, this paint that used to have scratch, scratch, what they call it now. Tesco. Those days, you paint Tesco inside room. Ah, you are a big boy. I said, Tesco. Then he kept me inside one room, alone. I say, eh, my friend has two bedrooms. What am I doing? I didn't sleep. Some of you, as they keep you inside that room, you will just lie on the bed. I'll be snoring. No. When you see those mental imaginations, you should be imagining yourself, dear. How can I get here? power of a dream. I didn't sleep. I could not sleep. I said, no, is it not the same money two of us are collecting? How is it get so that it, I didn't sleep? He noticed that I didn't sleep. I said, I was asleep. I said, oh God, I didn't sleep. Oh, I want to see you. I kept waiting for him to open the door. Let me ask him how manage. And when he told me the how manage, I said, what? Every money the man will get, he will buy an equipment. Buy CD mass production machine. As we go out, they give us more of the change. Somebody is producing CDs for the man here. Something is adding. Paid for shop. Got some other extra equipment. With the 10 10 naira. It's one of the deeds that I will talk about. Today's dream. I started dreaming. I said, no! I was living in one village. In Sokka. Behind Federal House. Not even in Federal House. Behind Federal House. At the back side of the desert. I came back. I told my wife. I will treat you well. Don't worry. I started thinking. How can I dream? 
if you go to that big hotel, not to be saying, hi, this is a fine or hey, it's EPOP. Without thinking of how, how can this be? It can be to you. You can also own it. If you're not a dreamer, you will be so relaxed. I don't like people who are so contented. Contentment is with godliness, great gain. But not to, to the point it becomes complacency. Everything is okay. Ah, ah. Mental pictures, sometimes you need to create them. It was during that same period. <laughs> One day I was going out and my wife was telling me, how about we have our house, big house, we was just calling the DC and we invite our house. Daddy, my father is saying, Daddy will come with mommy. They will just come. We'll give them one room. I say, How many rooms are we going to have? He said, Three now or four. I say, Ah, okay, okay. I was just believing God with how anything she talked. I say, Okay. But after a while, a seed was sown into my heart. I said, But we can't actually. Somebody who had already tried to sow a negative seed telling me that this Abuja, before you make it, it will take like 10 years old or 15 years. Say, I've been here for 15 years. I'm not old. So I was already running with that mental seed before I woke up. I told myself, come out! I'm dreaming something new. Something new. That dream has come to pass. Dream. Tell your neighbor, dream. Tell another person, oh God, dream. Aspire. 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 <laughs> have a mental picture. Have a goal. So people are working without a goal aimlessly. So every day you'll be coming for prayer points. Don't have that this day. I told you about the picture of the house rent. It's 500 naira every day. Who can work for five? Who can make five hundred? Is this five hundred naira very difficult to make it? It's not very difficult. It can be hard if you are doing something. You know, sometimes we we'll throw our castle in the air. We think that one day, one day go better. No, 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 no. It go better. But why you are waiting for the it go better? Be doing something. Be doing something. Don't be the type of person that would think that one day it will happen. Be a planner. Dream. Tell your neighbor, dream. Tell another person, dream. Tell another person, aspire. Tell another person, have a vision. Tell another person, have a mental picture. Oh, Dream makes you to plan. If people who are planless, they don't have a dream. Anything goes. Let us go to Lube area one. We are doing something there. They are doing one. This is there. You say, where? Oh, yeah, enter the car. You enter. No plan. I'm not doing anything. How can you wake up? You are not doing anything. There's nothing to do. There's something to do somewhere. There's something to do. If you have a target to save just 1,000 or 500 every day, you try to find a way to make sure you get that 1,000 every day or 500 or 200. Calculate for me. If you will save 200, 200 naira every day, you are keeping it somewhere. 200 naira. 200 naira. By the end of the year, you can rent a small shop. Even if it's a tech, I don't know if it's thousand shops in the villages. They are now. Eh? You can! Why do you like to just be looking for people to who are labored and kept to give you? No, that is not this church. We will aspire. We will go out. It's difficult, but we will do it hard. People who are making it, they did it hard. 
people sweat it out. So in this season, after we have prayed and prayed like this, we must dream. Tell somebody again, dream. A dream will make you to choose the people you hang around with. It's not everybody that is going your route. Let's go into area one. You, you are going to Lokoja. You enter his car. Where will you land? You will land in area one, Ogiri. <laughs> no, look for the people that are going towards that side. And follow them. Follow them. A dream will make you change the people you hang around. A dream will change your decisions. People who have common goals follow those people. Do you know that you are 80% influence of things around you? 80% of you is your people who have influence. Influence. 80%. You make moves with influence. Decisions, influence. Eh? Steps you take, influence. Something made you to think that this, this thing I'm talking about is influence. Hmm? Some people would change some attitudes today because of influence. Some people will wake up and think that, oh, this 200,000, somebody sent me a message sir, for five years. I have not seen 150,000 in my account for five years. And the person is not a 30 year person for five years. But do you know it's possible to keep that 150,000 if you decide today? Today. Today. People are moved towards people that have projects. People don't give to needs. People give to projects more than needs. You don't know. I have a restaurant here. I need some rice to do this. Thing. Somebody will do it easily with that to say I need rice to go and eat chicken. I want to eat chicken today. Okay, give me 2005. Let me eat chicken. You remove like that. How I many I don't eat? That I'll be removing like that. And some of them that are very carefree, they are the ones that eat more than the people that work. Tell yourself, I am not that type of person. You didn't say it with confidence. Say it again. I am not that type of person. A dream will make you to endure. Hebrews chapter 12 verse 2. A dream will make you to endure. There are some things you endure. Not because that is who you are. I'm doing Okada now. Does not mean my life is all about Okada. will make you I'm only trying to keep some of you need to go and do a kada you are being stupid but I say no <laughs> no you are being stupid go and drive a bike if you keep 500 every day what happens you have saved what our question was what 500 and what 560. If you keep it every day, you are doing Okada. Three passengers you have kept that. Or four. Or five. Eh? Is it not so? Eh? And you kept diligently. I would do one of the days is diligent. So when we come diligent, we'll talk about it. You have kept 200 and 200,000 in a year, that Christmas should be a good Christmas. Some of you have never spent a hundred thousand on Christmas. But you can actually do 250 naira every day. You will get a thousand naira on Christmas. Start this Christmas. Don't wait till Christmas start now. Dream! Dream! It's a dream that will make you disciplined. To go and be doing a I remember when I was working 
I told myself, because of this man, album. Let me get a job in the hotel. I went to the hotel. I was looking for a hotel to be a receptionist. Some of the hotel, I, I, I was, I saw one of the hotels that last time I said my wife, that, my wife, look at one of the hotels I came out to beg for a job. I can buy the hotel. It's still there. As I speak now, it's one tiny hotel. I can buy it. I can pay that dog. I shut this place down. But there was a season in my life. I went to look for a job there. It's not up to 20 years. A man with a dream must rise. That way you are not dreaming. Everything is fine. Let's do this. It's fine. No, everything is not fine. A dream does not just work in one day. Give some target. You know, sometimes we do one. It's only Yahoo, Yahoo. Hear me. Yahoo, Yahoo. Now you no need faith and patience. You no need patience. But even Yahoo, Yahoo. It needs patience. Before you go scam a client. What are you talking about? <laughs> I know how many times they try. Some of them risk their lives. Yahoo, Yahoo. It's a risk. What in this world is not a risk? Do the good risk. I hear you, man. That you are doing Okada does not mean you are an Okada for life. It just means that for this season, you are passing through to somewhere. Some of you need to get a car that can run area one back to Pogolada for a season. Jesus endured the cross for the joy ahead. He endured the cross. You didn't give me that scripture. Shabala Rokoshekot. Hebrews chapter 12, verse 2. Looking on to Jesus. The author and the finisher of our faith. That's the man we should relate, right? Who for the joy. There is a joy ahead. Just drive the Okada. You go black for two, two, three months. But after that, there's a freshness. Do I look like somebody who has stayed somewhere and was cleaning? I dress water. I wash toilets. For one good year, what made me to run away from the place? One day the woman comes in and says, Where is that? I was doing everything at a small hotel. So I will wash the toilet. I will dress the bed. I will clean the reception. I will clean the rooms. But I applied to be a receptionist here, man. The work is many. I was doing everything. I was a cleaner. Receptionist. Everything because of a dream. I needed 7,000 every month to produce a song. The dream made me to stay there, no problem. I will be there. Every day I walk. The hotel pay me five thousand. Church I was playing keyboard for pay me four thousand. I go home with nine thousand. I go and pay my producer seven thousand. The two thousand I used to maintain myself. I buy enough gary. Thousand and sugar. Then my be. I'll be worshipping. I know every shortcut from Lugbe Federal House to Lugbe Across. Thousand. That time it was only one lane. Ten thousand. I trek from the police station, that total police station there. Lugbe Across every day. I was so happy doing it. Happy doing it. And that has helped me. If you enter my room, nobody cleans my room to the taste. My taste. I clean my room. Downstairs, my children can do it. But upstairs, I have upstairs 
two bedroom upstairs and a parlor. I clean it myself. I dress my bed. In fact, I let the if my wife dressed, I said, no, you didn't do it well. I come back. My wife lost me one of those things for this dress, dressing up bed. She said, me love, this bed is not really like you. It's not you that did it. I said, yes, not me. <laughs> I still had an added advantage from the hotel I worked. Do something! Dream! A dream get me! Stay there! I'm not going anywhere! I must do this album of God 12 years. Don't, I mean 12 months. Don't as planned. The album was in my hand. Yes, you, yes, you. It was in my hand. I am not a receptionist. I only pass through this route. And my friend that was with me, he said, no, sir. Me, I can't do this recession. He said, no. I'm a minister. It's from him. I say hearing that word, minister. I even went to Panam College of Music Ministry. But this man was teaching me ministry more than I even knew. He said, no, as a minister, you may not need to be staying in a recession. People will be asking you. And truly, I saw some odd things. They spotted on Jesus. People who were not this parted on him. But for the joy that was before him, he endured it. I had to endure. I saw beer pass in front of me. I had to endure. Lord, I must do this album. I will wash and wash and wash. My body will ache. I said, no, I will be here. Oh God, add something to this 4,000 we're collecting. He said, no, I will not, my brother. That is not my decision. You are demeaning me. As I speak, early this year, he calls me, son, that ejected me and my wife and my baby from that room we were staying. Put a dream. 
dream. If you don't have a 10 year plan, you are not doing well. I'm telling you, you are not doing well. Go and recheck yourself. Some people don't as good as have a one year plan. January to February to December, you are praying creative days. Shaba, shaba, shaba. Nothing in your front. What am I fighting? What am I fighting? Shaba, daba. What am I fighting? Is there nothing you are fighting in this life? You will live a compressed life. If there's something you are fighting, every day you wake up, you try to move towards it. Let me capture this. You may not capture all at once, sir. They don't capture all at once. But you bite small. Come back and rejoice. Give testimony. Some testimony here today are small, small. Sometimes we see tight of 100 naira. I like those tights. Because I see 100 million in them. Dream! Dream! I like you to stand up on your feet and pray, Lord, help me. Pray, 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 pray. Lord, help me to be a dreamer. Ten thousand, my beloved again. My beloved, the most beautiful church amongst thousands. Ten thousand, sing it again, my beloved. My A dream will make you dream or take the odd job. No problem. No problem. No problem. Let them mock you. No problem. They will come back to celebrate with you.
Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Spring up. Shut up more. New favor. New love from the people. May the businesses shine more. May you smell beautiful. May people just love to patronize you. In the mighty name of Jesus. Put your hands together for them as they walk back to their and drop their sins. My beloved, my Sunday Word Service by 9 a.m. Foundation of Truth Assembly Raising Godly People